Right, following some breaking news out of South Tacoma this morning where we are seeing a very serious crash. It's happening in the neighborhood south of 84th Street between I-5 and State Route 7. That is where Fox 13's John Hopperstead joins us right now with the very latest. Hi, John. Hi, Liz. Yeah, and we're learning that unfortunately a 64-year-old woman died in this crash, though it might not have been from the actual head-on crash that you see here behind me, which has completely shut down Yakima Avenue here between 88th and 86th. Police believe she suffered some kind of medical emergency. The woman that was driving the darker vehicle, the gray vehicle there, that caused her to swerve into the oncoming lane heading northbound on Yakima, hitting that white car head on. Now, the driver of that car is a 34-year-old woman. She was taken to the hospital with minor injuries. And by the way, this happened right near Fern Hill Elementary School. In fact, the uh, speed limit sign was flashing at 20 miles per hour when this happened. But again, and a medical emergency may have caused this woman to speed up as she went into that lane and hit that car head on. The cause still under investigation right now. Uh, investigators out here, they've just had a drone up taking pictures of the street here. And the uh, medical examiner is going to release the official cause and death of this. Uh, the investigative team says this road, though, may be shut down for a few more hours as they look into this because this is considered now a fatal crash here in Tacoma this morning. So if you're driving in this area of Yakima, especially between 80 and 86, you can follow this area and take a different direction. We're live in Tacoma. John Opperson, Fox 13 News.